Hey everyone, Jonathan Allen here from Camp RV in Stratford, Ontario. Today's video I'm going to show you through the 2019 Solaire 205 SS. This one here is a 20 foot box ultralight travel trailer made by Palomino RV. It weighs just under, or just over 4,300 pounds. It's 4,358 pounds to be exact. It does have a power slide out with a queen walk around bed at the front and good sized bathroom at the back. But I'll uh, give you a nice walk around here and then we'll check out the interior, show you all the nice features. As uh, most of them have, the 220 pound propane tanks on the front. It's got the hard plastic cover with the easy access hatch on the top. It's got a power tongue jack on the front and then that has a built in light on it as well. You got a three quarter fiberglass cap and that's got built in LED lights. You can, we do have them on but I know it's tough to see in the sun right now but you can see the blue LED light there. Also has LED marker lights up at the top. Uh, and then you do have the diamond plating down down below to prevent any stone chips on any of the fiberglass. It's got four corner stabilizer jacks, so there's one on each corner that crank up and down. Large pass-through storage compartment at the front. So they have slam latch baggage doors, and then you do have a magnet that'll hold that door open. And that goes right through from one side to the other. So you can see all linoleum floor, so it's easy to clean and sweep out. You got a motion sensor light in here that'll turn on and off automatically. And then the switch here is for the uh, lights on the uh, front cap there. And then as I mentioned, slam latch doors. So with those, they just slam shut. You got uh, pre-wiring for a portable solar panel. So Furion makes a portable panel that can plug right in. It's got a power awning with built-in LED lights on it. Just touch a button, goes in and out. The LED lights are built into the roller tube. Now on the other side, you do have the slide out. So that's in the main living area and we'll show you the nice open space you get inside because of that. You got access to your storage from the other side here. The water heater's over here as well as all the hookups. So your fresh water holding tank fill valve is there. Also the city water connection is there. At the back here, you do have outside shower. It's got your black tank flusher, cable and satellite hookups. You got an outdoor light. And then you've got your 30 amp marine style detachable power connection. There is an indicator light on there to tell you when you do have power coming in. Sewer connections down at the bottom with the black and gray water pull valves. And as you can see, they're aluminum wheels, nitro filled tires. As I mentioned, the four corner stabilizer jacks. So again, one on each corner. On the back here, we do have the spare tire mounted and it does come with a cover. All the Solaires are pre-wired for a backup camera, so the housing there right below the marker lights is where you could add a camera if you want. We order all of them with the outside barbecue. So the barbecue's inside in a box, but this bracket folds right around. The barbecue will mount right on top of it, and then there's a propane hookup underneath there, and that runs off the main tanks on the front. And then the fridge and the furnace vent are right on the back here. As I mentioned, the power awning, large entry assist handle beside the door that'll fold over the door during transit, but it gives you something to grab onto when you're getting in and out. It does have outdoor speakers, and the outdoor speakers are backlit with blue LED lights. Outside TV hookup is here as well, so you can mount a TV outside and plug it into cable and power. You got an exterior porch light as well. Uh, it does have the new set of stairs that fold down from within the door frame. So they just unlock and fold right down. You can see that they're adjustable, so if you're on unlevel ground, you can adjust them to make it level. And they fold right down, you can see it's got the aluminum treads. It's called the Solid Step, made by Lippert. They're nice, solid. They're a lot more solid than a regular trailer stair, and gives it a nicer look when you're driving down the road. You don't have the set of stairs hanging down below the step. It, they do use a friction hinge on the door. So rather than having a bracket, to hold the door closed for you. The friction hinge is a nice stiffer hinge that will keep that closed. And then your screen door will just reconnect right back to your main door. Now we put cardboard down to protect the floor but it does have the linoleum tile look flooring. It's all one piece. Right at the back here you've got your control panel right inside the door which has the awning control, the slide control and then all the lights and the water heater and water pump. Everything centrally located. Right beside the fridge, which the fridge is an eight cubic foot propane electric. This has got what they call the Mesa Maple interior. So it's an upgraded cabinet finish. 
You can see with that slide out gives you lots of open floor space. But you get the full size queen walk around bed, residential size queen. The bed will lift up for storage underneath. It's got gas shock arms that'll hold it up for you. That's the barbecue in the box there, but also you get a good amount of storage under there. You get a wardrobe cabinet on each side of the bed, plus some overhead cabinets and shelving up above there. You can see you got some nice LED accent lighting, which you can turn on and off. There's a roof vent above the bed, also a window on each side of the bed. All the windows have the pleated shades, which slide up and down. There's also a laundry chute beside the bed. That goes down into that front pass-through storage compartment. So you can just put a laundry basket down there, and as you have dirty, dirty laundry, you just throw it right down your laundry chute. You can see there's a power outlet on each side of the bed, so everybody can plug in their phones, or if you have a sleep apnea machine, which seems a lot of people do these days, you can plug them right in. The sofa is in the slide out, so it's a jackknife sofa. It will drop down into an extra bed. You've got the uh, movable table, so that table you can fold the legs up and put it outside if you don't have a picnic table, or you can fold it up and just have it out of the way for more floor space. You got cabinets up above, you can see there's little lights underneath the cabinets. All the interior lights are LED, so they're nice and bright and they're very energy efficient. The kitchen has a nice big stainless steel sink, and they have the new sink covers which they fold up. So when you're, when you're done your dishes, you can just set them right on top of those sink covers and let them drip dry into the sink. It is a pull-out faucet. So you do have the high-rise faucet with the pull-out sprayer. You can see cabinets up above. There's a skylight built right into the kitchen with a built-in shade. Just gives you lots of natural light. All the drawers are on ball bearings, so they slide in nice and smooth. They even they've added some USB ports in different areas throughout the trailer. Again, for charging all your portable devices. You can see good amount of cabinets and drawer storage. Three burner stove, which does have the flush flush mount glass cover. You get the knife holder in behind the stove. Those things just fold right up, gives you access to your three burners. You've got the oven down below, and then a built-in microwave up above. Wall mounted TV, which it does come with, and it is on a pull out mount. So you can pull that out and angle it. So if you're laying in bed and want to watch a movie or TV, you can. And the stereo is AM, FM, CD, DVD, and built in Bluetooth. So you can link it with your smartphone to listen to music outside, put volume up and down, change music, or if you want to watch a movie, slide your movie right in and it's going to play on your TV. And you can see a good amount of counter space. They're all solid surface countertops, so as opposed to being a, like a laminate style, it's more like a Corian style countertop. And then you can see again, nice big drawers down below, so lots of storage. And you got more pantry storage right across from the kitchen there. More storage beside the fridge back here as well. Quite a bit of storage for a 20 foot trailer. It gives you lots of room for storing items. Bathroom's right in the back corner here. So you got the corner shower with the sliding doors. It's got a full shower surround and the skylight up above. And then you got the vanity which does have storage down below and then there is a medicine cabinet as well. And then the foot flush toilet with an extra cabinet for storage up above. You can see you got the built-in fan so it's a fantastic fan. Three speeds, runs on 12 volt. AC is ducted through the ceiling. As I mentioned, all the lights are LED. And again, this one is shown in the Mesa Maple interior. So there is uh, another darker wood interior that is available as well. So as I mentioned, this is the 2019 Solaire 205 SS. Again, it's just over 4,350 pounds, 4,358 to be exact. We now have this model in stock at Camp RV in Stratford. Now we do have quite a few Solaires as well as Pumas, full Palomino lineup. We have quite a few units in stock. But you can check out all of our available inventory on our website, which is campoutrv.com. Uh, we'd love to have you here, so if you want to stop in, we'll show you through this great floor plan and we can show you what else we have in stock. You can follow us on social media, we have a great Facebook page, Instagram, our YouTube channel is spot on. Uh, but like we said, we'd love to have you here. So thanks again for watching the video, have a great day.